Is working hard today. Can I help, Grandpa? I can hammer nails. <laughs> I'm sure you can, Franny. But this hammer is much too big for you. There. All done. Can I polish them? I can make them really shiny. They don't need polishing. They need a new buckle. See? Right here. Hmm. Here's the buckle box. How about this one? <laughs> Bellissimo. But I have one right here. It matches the other shoe. What can we do for you? My boot seems to have sprung a leak. They're a bit muddy. <laughs> I'd say they're very muddy, but that's no problem. We'll have them good as new in no time. Franny, could you please put these in the fix-it box? Sure, Grandpa. Where will my feet take me today? Wow, this place is fluffy. You're on a wolf farm. What did you say? I said, you're on a wolf farm. I've never visited a wolf farm before. I could show you around if you'd like. That would be fantastic! I'm Franny. What's your name? Walter. Pleased to meet you, Walter. Come on, there's lots to see. <laughs> That's Mrs. Farmer Higglepuff. She's milking Petal. <laughs> me, me, me! La, 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 la. <clears throat> Who's that? That's Leonard. He wakes us up every morning at the crack of dawn. Ah! Do -do -do -do. That was a cockle doodle doozy. Huh? Who's this, this, this? Franny, this is Bobby Jean. My real name's Bobby Jean, but you can call me Bobby. I don't mind a bit, bit, bit. And you can call me Franny. My real name is Francis, but my mom only calls me Francis when she wants me to come in a hurry. Walter is showing me around the farm. Is he now? Well then, come with me. Come, come, come. Eggs. That's my line of work, work, work. Bobby laid an egg. Good work, Bobby. Thank you. Thank you. Come on. There's lots more to see. I was wondering where the wool was. It's fantabulous. I know. I hope Mr. Farmer Higglepuff wins. Wins? The Octum Fair. Every 
Every year, he knits a sweater and enters. We're all rooting for him to win a ribbon this year. <laughs> Shouldn't you go with the other sheep, Walter? No, I... I don't actually. It's time for the shearing. Shearing? What's that? When wool grows long, the farmer shears it off and makes it into yarn. It's like getting a haircut. But why aren't you getting sheared too? Walter? What's wrong? Oh, it's nothing. It's just that everyone has a job but me. Don't you give wool like the other sheep? I'm not woolly enough. If I were, my wool could be used in Mr. Farmer Hagelbuff's Autumn Fair sweater. But it'll never happen. I'm too unwoolly. I'm unwoolly Walter. Poor Walter. We have to help him. I know. <laughs> Do you think it will work? Absolutely. When my hair gets flat, my mom gives it a shampoo. Ready for the rinse? before a party. And it makes her hair big and puffy. There, all done. <gasps> I'm so... unwoolly. Oh, no! Thanks for your help, Franny. But it's no use. I'll never have fluffy wool. And I'll never be able to do the job a sheep is supposed to do. It's finished. <laughs> uh, what do you think? It's fantastic. It is rather nice, but you know, I wish it had that extra something special so that it would win the ribbon just this once. Something special? Hmm. I've got it. Soft and woolly. Walter! Hi, Franny. You may not have the most wool, but you do have the softest wool. And I know just what to make out of it. We won a ribbon, thanks to all our flock and to Walter. This is the softest hat I've ever felt, and I just know it helped us win the ribbon. Thanks. Franny. You're welcome. Thank you for showing me around. But I have to get back to my grandpa's now. Bye! <laughs> that was fantastic! Another treasure for my shoebox. I'm all finished my work. Let's have a snack before your mom and dad get here. Okay. We can have some of Petal's milk and Bobby Jean's eggs. 
You can call her Bobby. She doesn't mind one bit, bit, bit. Petal, Bobby Jean, who are they? From the wool farm. Cock-a-doodle-doo! That's Leonard's job. And I have one, too. You do? I put the shoes in the fix-it box for you. Yes, you do. <laughs> and you're very good at it, too. Thanks, Grandpa. Where will my feet take me tomorrow? Where are we going? You'll see. <laughs> Come inside. We can have our snack together. You want me to go in there? Just try, Grandpa. It's fun. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I'm too big. I have to get back to fixing the shoes. <sighs> okay, Grandpa. A customer! And what can I do for you? The strap is broken on my favorite sandals. A stitch here, a square of glue there, and presto, good as new. Right, Franny? Right. I'll put them in the fix-it box for you. Thank you. They'll be ready on Friday. Where will my feet take me today? <laughs> Trippity flip-flops. What a fantabulous place! What's that? Hi there, I'm Franny. Oh, I'm Herman. What are you doing? I'm trying to fit. Oh, almost, almost inside my house. Oh, <laughs> there, I did it. Ooh, ooh. Uh oh, now you're stuck. I could pull you. Might as well give it a try. Ready? Here goes. <laughs> <laughs> Are you okay? Fine, thanks. Oh, except for the fact that my house has shrunk. I've never heard of a house shrinking before. Maybe it didn't shrink. Maybe you grew. Me? Grow? Hmm. I do look bigger. What do you know? I grew! What am I talking about? This is terrible. I'm too big for my house. I need a hard shell for protection. Where will I live now? Nowhere. That's where. When my feet get too big for my shoes, my mom gets me a bigger pair. Maybe we can get you a bigger house. Ah, good idea. Oh, but my old house was perfect. I'll never find another one like it. Where did you find this one? Uh, on the shore. There's bound to be more of them. Come on. <laughs> Find a new one. It looks a bit big. A bit? It's so big I could get lost in there. I should have known. One's too big, one's too small. I'll never find one that's just right. Sure you will. We just gotta keep looking. Hmm, that's the spirit. Hmm, keep looking. I couldn't agree more. Huh? 
You're a turtle. Indeed I am. <laughs> Riley T. Turtle's the name. I'm Franny. Your shell is as hard as a rock. Oh, that's what I need. A nice hard shell. Shell? Hmm. I believe I saw one down along the beach. You did? Was it Herman's size? Hmm. Hard to tell. Hard to tell. Could very well be. Fantastic! Come on, Herman. Let's skedaddle. Thanks, Riley. It was nice meeting you. There don't seem to be any shells around here. What's that? There's something inside of it. Hmm. Clippity Crab Claws. It's a treasure map. Treasure map? Treasure map? Oh, 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 we're gonna be rich! Oh, 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 what are we waiting for? Come on! <laughs> it's that way. Oh. Hmm, we should be getting close. It's the treasure! Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, I can hardly wait. Gold, jewels, riches! Fisherman's nets! Fisherman's nets! I knew it. No treasure, no house, no nothing. Sorry, Herman. I know how much you wanted to find a house. I guess we got distracted by the bottle. The bottle? Why didn't I think of that before? Think of what? I can live in this bottle. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh, yeah. it's hard like a shell, and I could crawl right inside. I'm not so sure about that, Herman. Let's keep looking. There's lots of seashore left to explore, and a pop bottle isn't the best house for a... Herman? service. But I must be off now. Bye, Riley. There. You're safe now. <sighs> oh, boy. I won't be doing that again. Thanks for rescuing me, Franny. It looks like the chest held the treasure after all. It did? This net. It helped me rescue you and catch this. Oh, shell! <laughs> hey, what do you know? Oh, yeah! Cozy and comfy, but not too tight. Oh, this is the best home ever. And you are the best friend ever. You're a great friend too, Herman. I better get back to my grandpa's now. I stay with him most afternoons. Bye, Franny! Fantastic! Ooh! Another treasure for my shoebox!
Where are you going in such a hurry? Nowhere. I'm already in your cozy home, just like Herman. Herman? Who is a Herman? A hermit crab. He tried to live in a bottle, but it got swept out to sea. Riley T. Turtle and I rescued him. Oh, and Grandpa, you're too big for my playhouse. I am? That's too bad. We can have our snack in the kitchen instead. Good idea. Where will my feet take me tomorrow? <laughs>